Well, that's because Pepsi doesn't exist. Ah! You're in Karenport now. There's no such thing as Pepsi. In ancient times, a ship, a clipper if you will, barreled down the highway. Briarcrest, unbeknownst to many people now involved with the school, was started off as actually a, a hair salon school. We named ourselves just after one of the tools. Hope. Hope. That's a good question. Anyway, you can. Um, I would suggest you not look into that. Underground railroad of sorts. You, you need to leave Karenport. This actually comes to me straight from the Premier of Saskatchewan who made the decision in the first place. The majority of Saskatchewan people do not know how to operate a clock. Why? Why be on it? I've been saying for years, what are we saving? Nothing! Rest in case. Daylight savings time. I thought we were here to be saving souls. What is there not to do in Moose Jaw? Spelunking, searching for more tunnels to exploit some fine coffee shops, ride an ice block into water. What else do they have? Call me. Absolutely. <laughs> no! <laughs> Those are all my bikes! That's like saying, do I need to fear Disneyland? Do I need to fear the Amazon rainforest. Mickey's my friend. The creatures in the rainforest are my friends. Let's see here. Uh, my address is unlisted for a very good reason. I've found myself to be very stockable. The question isn't who lives where, but why. Well, the troll lives underneath the bridge. The bridge in this case would be the little pipe that you drive over uh, on the way to the four-way stop on Center Street there. It's how come hot dogs come in packages of 12? And hot dog buns come in packages of 8? I believe that would be the English version. Oh! What a silly question! It's like asking, what's your favorite version of Spanish? One, there's only one version of Spanish. Spanish. Everything I do is scientific. A syllabus, or in the plural, a syllabi. Uh, that wouldn't be a, that would be some syllabi. You know what? You'll pick it up. Because? They call it a syllabus because they don't call it a little information sheet for your class. Um, well, you need it, because without the syllabus, you won't know what it is you're doing in your class. Because... Ad drops are stuff you do in gym class. Well, that's uh, an instruction you typically find on the back of a Visine bottle. You need to add drops to your eye. <laughs> Sorry, that's just your old man getting funny there again. It's not that big of a deal. I'm not gonna be too happy about it. <laughs> I just paid for three years of you to go to little little flute school there or whatever it was, all right? That's not working out very well for us. And now you wanna go push pencils for the rest of your life. Change, deal, do, live. It's my motto. It's my scientific motto. Okay, fear. You know the, you know the saying, fear is for horses? How it applies here. It's for horses, not children. Not adults. Certainly not you. Uh, there, there is no saying that fear is for horses. A format guide is your ticket to paradise. It's like saying trains get in this order so we can go to Amsterdam. All the train cars line up at the caboose at the very end. The caboose is the one at the very end. And they get in a little train and we're going to Amsterdam. <laughs> Well, that's typically, um, you know what? Why don't you ask your mother about that one? You elect to take them the same way that you elect to be on the ball. 
when class is in session. The question is, though, are you going to not only elect to be in a class, but are you going to elect to be on the ball when the teacher is putting stuff on the table? Uh, well, you'd think it would be, because they're the ones that are paying for all of this, aren't they? No, no, it's not your mom and dad's Briarcrest anymore, because you're allowed to wear denim to classes. Oh! <laughs> If your parents still went to school, and you went to school too, it'd be like parents, parents and children going to school next to the, I'm working on this assignment, Dad. I'm working on the same thing. What? That blows my mind. I didn't know this was going to happen, son. I didn't know this was going to happen, Dad. Ah!